Hi world, so looking through the comment section lately on my videos, especially the I hate memes video that I did when I was about 12, and brilliant. Be one of those whiny guys that just whinges about his hater comments, but it's starting to get a bit stressful now. Someone tells you to kill yourself, that, that that's a little bit irritating. I think you can imagine how I feel. Yes, uh, what a lovely gentleman. Okay, on a more serious note, today I want to talk to you about internet culture and how people act on the internet. Okay, when it comes to the internet, I have mixed emotions. Um, I think somehow it's my best friend, but it's also my worst enemy. Lots of good come out, can come out of it. Some, a lot of bad stuff can come out of it. I think you all know that. I believe the internet is what I call a frenemy, where you're kind of bad friends, good enemies. You know what I mean? I mean, a lot of the time, my head kind of battles with itself, deciding whether the internet is the revolution, and it's the pathway to a utopian future, or it'll turn the world into a post-apocalyptic wasteland. Like Fallout 3. I mean, in my point of view, people refuse to see this, but stuff like Twitter and Facebook and Instagram and even Xbox Live are the prime example of social networks with horrible user bases in terms of behaviour online, in my opinion. I think people choose to act like horrible people online because they're hiding behind a keyboard and they think it's all virtual reality and there's no they don't realise that there's another person on the other side of the line with emotions and feelings and a self-esteem. Why do internet trolls act the way they are? As Professor Ewan Silburn from the Institute of Twat, we will be investigating why internet trolls choose to make others feel bad. <laughs> Reason 1. The trolls feel bad about themselves, so they try and bring others down to their level. Like this diagram. Good morning. What are you saying, mate? Later, at home. Mummy, tuck me into bed. Oh, Gabriel, I'm already late for the bachelor party. What about those charming schoolboys that you know in person that you can't completely cut out of your life? Hmm. What's up, gay boy? What did you say? I didn't say nothing. Jeez. Why does everyone pretend to be my friend because they're scared of me? But don't actually like me. <sighs> oh God! <sighs> so yes, that's the conclusion. Bullies try to take others down to their level and try and make them feel bad. So them and all their buddies, or their bros, can feel better about themselves by pointing fun at others and doing unreasonable things to them. But we all know one thing for sure, it looks really, really stupid. Oh, so many peasants. Oh, crap. That's it for this video, I hope you enjoyed it. If you want more, you can subscribe and enjoy more of me complaining about the horrors of the world. Stay alternative and don't change for anyone.